Chang'e 4 has gone where no spacecraft has gone before, the far side of the moon, the side hidden from Earth. Images released on Chinese state television show the robotic lander descending towards the 1,500-mile-wide von Karman crater near the lunar south pole, and it sent back the first picture of its new home. It's a technological leap for the Chinese. Direct communication to the far side is impossible because signals would be blocked by the bulk of the moon. So they have to place a satellite in a particular orbit to relay instructions and send back the data. Now starts the science. The Lunar Explorer touched down on a side of the moon we never see because it rotates at the same speed that it orbits the Earth. Chang'e 4 and its robotic rover is in the largest crater on the moon's surface, a nine-mile deep scar from an ancient impact that punched through the lunar crust. Analyzing normal inaccessible rocks for unusual minerals will be a priority. What you might expect is that we, we get a sort of look at the lunar interior. Now, it's a lunar interior that has been exposed to space for billions of years, so it, it isn't going to be pristine in that sense. But nonetheless, it probably will be very different to the stuff we've seen already from the missions uh, that went to the near side, including the Apollo program. So for that alone, it's a, a completely different landscape. The Chinese mission is significant for its geopolitics too. The United States and Russia have dominated space for decades, but China is becoming ever more confident about its technology and wants a strategic presence on the celestial stage. If the mission finds rich deposits of minerals that are rare on Earth, it could make lunar mining far more attractive. And 50 years after the Americans landed on the moon, this mission is also about preparing the way for Chinese taikonauts to explore the surface and perhaps even establish a base there which could act as a refueling station to take on water and the oxygen you can make from it for the long journey to Mars.